Hashtag Sizz50K, take your hat off. Oh gosh, you guys, I knew this day would come, and I, I didn't want it to come to this, but you guys asked for it, so here you go. You happy now? <laughs> Anyway, yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Jack aka Scissors here. Welcome back to another video and I just gotta start this one off with saying thank you. Literally, you guys have been leaving so many views, comments, and likes on every single video. It's fucking insane. You guys, you guys are just amazing, so thank you. And anyway, without further ado, let's just get right into this Q&A. Luke Marshall asks, what is your favorite COD and what are your thoughts on Infinite Warfare and COD 4 Remastered? Will you play them both? Personally, I think they both look amazing, okay? COD 4 is a great game, so Remastered is gonna be epic and then Infinite Warfare, it looks similar to BO3, and I love BO3, obviously you guys know that. The movement looks similar, obviously the gameplay and the guns are going to be different and everything, but still, I'm excited for both of them. I'm definitely going to be playing both of them and probably streaming both of them. I'm not sure which one I'm going to play more, we'll just have to wait and see until they come out. Zachary asks, what was your first console? I answered a question similar to this in my last Q&A, but my first console ever was the Nintendo 64, okay? It wasn't personally mine, like it was my brothers and sisters that they just kind of like handed it down to me, but I love love that thing. I would literally, I still play it actually. Super Smash Bros, Mario Kart, obviously The Legend of Zelda, okay, all the games, there are so many classics on that system and it's probably my favorite system to be honest. Even though the controller looks like a freaking three-pronged dildo or some shit. <laughs> Do you plan on coming out with apparel? Cause I'll definitely buy some. I was actually just thinking about this the other day and for sure, 100%, I'm definitely gonna have apparel in the future. Not sure when, maybe when we hit 100,000 subscribers or something, I don't know. It really depends on you guys, okay, whether or not you guys would want it or not. So. So if I see enough comments on this video saying like, yeah, I'd get apparel or something, maybe we'll do it sooner. I don't know. We'll see what happens. What was your favorite video game growing up? Oh my gosh. One favorite video game. I don't know if I can actually like narrow it down to just one. Okay. So I'm going to roll through a bunch right here. Okay. So for the PC, Roller Coaster Tycoon, that game was this shit. I don't know if it was one or two. Either way, Roller Coaster Tycoon was amazing. All the backyard sports like football, soccer, hockey, baseball, those were all so much fun. I guess it depends on what you define growing up as, like eight years old, 12 years old, whatever. So that's why I'm just naming a bunch of them. So those ones, then obviously Legend of Zelda, Super Smash Bros. Um, there was like this little mini console. It wasn't even like a console. It's literally just like a joystick. If I find a picture of it, I'll put it on the screen right now. But it's literally just like a joystick with Miss Pac-Man and a bunch of old classic games. I'd plug it into the TV and literally all you had was just one little joystick and it was that was really fun. I played that a lot growing up. Replays asks, how do you feel about your channel's growth recently? I freaking hate it. Please stop subscribing. No, honestly, it's the coolest feeling ever. You guys are killing the support and I love it and I just can't thank you enough for that. What would your job be if you weren't doing YouTube? I don't know how many of you guys know this, but I'm actually 20 years old in my junior year of college. So this, this whole YouTube thing right now, it's, it's not a job for me. I hope maybe in the near future, maybe in the future sometime. And the fact that you use the term job, okay, it's definitely not a job. I'd never consider it a job because this YouTube right now is the most fun thing ever. Like watching you guys' support and comments and everything is just, it's so much fun. I could never consider it a job. Obviously you can make money off of YouTube, but I would never consider it like a job. Maybe a career is the right term. I, I don't know. So yeah, maybe in the future, but as of right now, no, I'm still in school. Trevor asks, would you rather know how you will die or when you will die? Oh gosh, either way, that that's just a shitty feeling. Um, I guess I'd have to go with how I would die because if you knew when you die, like the exact date, then you'd just be counting down the days until that day and then, well, when that day comes, you're just like, well, sh shit, I, I guess I'm gonna die today. That's just a terrible thought. Yeah, I'd definitely go with how you'd die. Shane asks, do you play any sports or have you before? Yes, actually, I love sports, okay? I've played sports all my life, ever since I was probably like four, five, or six years old. I don't know exactly when I started, but I've played hockey, soccer, lacrosse, football, baseball, basketball, even though I freaking hate basketball, okay? I've played pretty much every organized sport there is, except for tennis, okay? Okay, professional tennis players, they, they just kind of creep me out. So I've played soccer and hockey pretty much every single year all throughout my life. I've also played football a lot, okay? I played football until eighth grade, but I was just too small. I hit my growth spurt way late, so I couldn't play in high school. I was just way too small. Soccer was more fun, and I was better at soccer, actually, so I played that in high school. Played hockey all through high school, and I actually played lacrosse, but only for two years in high school. Another similar question, Charlie Turner asks, Messi or Ronaldo? I'm gonna have to go with Messi on this one, okay? Obviously, both players are freaking amazing. They're so fun to watch, but... Messi 
sassy just a little I just like him a little bit more what do your parents slash friends think of your channel this might shock some of you guys but to be honest my parents have no idea about my YouTube channel I'm planning on telling them this winter probably in December or something when I go home from school for winter break that's when I'll probably tell them and I'm really curious to how they're gonna take it but as far as my friends go most of my friends know about my YouTube channel my real close friends are the ones who are like really supportive of it and to be honest I'm fairly certain that some of them think that this whole YouTube thing is stupid as shit it's a waste of time and well those friends, they they really aren't friends in the first place, so fuck them. Why do you not play PS4? I don't play PS4 simply because I don't have one, okay? I only play on Xbox One as of right now, but before October starts, I will be getting a PS4, so that's real exciting stuff. Defend My Oreo asks, what made you make your own game mode? It's talking about Running With Scissors, the custom games where basically you guys are all on one team trying to kill me, and a bunch of you advance on the next rounds and keep going on, and it's a lot of fun, but the way I made it actually, okay, I used to play Free Run a lot back in the day. I was like top three at one point. I don't know what I am now. I haven't even paid attention to that shit. But literally right when Black Ops 3 came out, that's like what I did religiously. Okay, I would get home and play free run i would go to sleep wake up and play free run literally free run free run free run non-stop every day all day i would just obsess about getting like a brand new record or a brand new time and it was it was such a good feeling and that's how i actually have like learned the movement system in black ops 3 since i got the movement down so well since i was like one of the fastest black ops 3 players i figured it would be fun to have people chase me while i like free run through the map so yeah basically free run led to me making running with scissors spammo asks would you rather skydive or bunny jump. I'm a huge pussy when it comes to heights, okay? I'm so afraid of heights, but I've always wanted to skydive, okay? I'm starting to get over my fear of heights, and skydiving would seem really fun. Bungee jumping, I feel like I just wouldn't trust it. What makes you strive to be the best at what you do every day? It sounds corny, but you guys, okay? When I read your comments, your positive comments, it's like, wow, okay, that, that just makes me want to do this that much more. Honestly, guys, it's you, okay? It, it's literally you. How do you get into one of your games? I am new. I'm assuming he's talking about my custom games running with scissors and I've tried to answer this and explain this so many times, but just follow me on Twitter, okay? We play every Thursday, every Sunday. I'll tweet out during those days what I'm going to be doing, when I'm going to be doing it, and all you have to do is just join my session on Xbox One. Pretty soon here, we'll be switching off between PS4 and Xbox One. We'll do like an every other week thing, but all you have to do is follow me on Twitter, okay? That's it. And then wait for my tweets on Thursday and Sunday, and if you really want to join, turn on my Twitter notifications. David asks, are you going to be joining people's parties again? Yes, okay. I had so much fun making that video so much fun talking to you guys so i'm definitely gonna be making more of those videos in the future it's not gonna be like a weekly thing maybe like an every other week thing i don't know all i can say is that it was amazing talking to you guys seeing your reactions and everything so yeah i'm definitely gonna join your xbox parties and your ps4 parties i don't know what they're called on there but i think that's gonna wrap up today's q a again guys all i can say is thank you i don't know what else to say okay i swear i say it every single freaking video but <laughs> thank you guys okay we're at fifty thousand. actually right now by the time you're watching this we're at like 58,000 which is just freaking crazy like this channel is growing so fast and you guys are leaving so many likes and so much support I just can't thank you enough so guys thank you for watching today's video if you enjoyed it please smash that like button it really does mean a lot anyway guys peace out homies I'll see you next time I, I, I used to feel so devastated uh, at times I thought we never make it